Next question is from Sarah Larson. What's the healthiest choice for alcohol? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's a funny question. And now, yeah. Okay, so before you answer this, Sal, because I'm sure you have an answer for it, um, when quote unquote healthiest, right? The, yeah. the if you read online and you Google stuff, that the the answer you're going to get is the lowest calorie one. Mm -hmm. Is there any other uh, alcohol choices that provide any other? I, wine, I know that the, they tout the antioxidants, yeah. right? Yeah. Can we look up gin too? I've heard a lot of people touting gin is like a shot, like having some kind of health benefit to it, uh -huh. and I don't know if that's like because vodka is one of the lowest calorie. Uh, it is. Yeah, drink like hard alcohol drinks. Well, that makes the most sense. Right? And so, if you were gonna if you were gonna do quote calorie. unquote healthiest, you would do something like tonic water and mm -hmm. vodka yeah. or a vodka shot would most likely, and that's purely not because it's healthier, but because it's lowest lowest calorie. Yeah. Okay. So first of all, there is no healthy alcohol. So. Yeah, that's why it's <laughs> yeah. hilarious. Question. Contrary to uh, you know popular media, um, there are no health benefits to alcohol. Now you could argue that maybe the health benefits could come from. Connecting with people, you know, the traditions that they involve. And yeah, there's health benefits to that, but the alcohol itself um, is not is not healthy. Now you will re and, and at all, by the way, it's connected any amount of alcohol increases risk of uh, of cancer, for example. And studies will show that. Um, so it's just not healthy at all. Doesn't mean you shouldn't drink it. I enjoy alcohol sometimes. It's not not that big of a deal. Um, now, as far as health is concerned, here's what you're gonna hear. You're gonna hear, well, wine contains antioxidants and resveratrol and gin contains these you know it's made from these berries juniper and berries tequila's <laughs> got this these 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 compounds that don't get utilized like sugar so it's better on insulin okay those are all such oh, like they always use the antioxidant angle it's to all of them are these minuscule thing like benefits to any of these drinks first of all you're not going to drink enough wine to gain whatever benefit you get from the yeah. antioxidant stuff <laughs> the alcohol Com negates it totally get <laughs> just as much from smelling a strawberry yes <laughs> yes <laughs> yeah blueberries you know just eat a couple blueberries yeah. in your set really what you want to look at is what what the biggest impact on my health uh negatively is going to come from the the calories right. from, and, and from the alcohol itself right. i could say this there you may be able to make an argument about like having a small hermetic effect if it's like not like that much but like you're introducing it almost as like anything else like you you know is like plants provide certain hermetic effect because of like certain toxic uh, uh elements there yeah i don't know i don't i don't you know like but, i said if you look at the studies on alcohol um, by itself, it's just not healthy. Again, though, sometimes it's connected to health because sometimes it's connected to other behaviors that may be healthy. For example, traditions, uh, rituals, uh, you know, maybe it helps you connect with your friends. Obviously, you can overdo that as well. But by itself, no, it's not healthy. And so, you, okay, if you want to pick the healthiest, you go with the lowest calorie and you hit the nail on the head. Right. It's vodka. Right. Bodybuilders had it right. You know, you look at bodybuilders when they go drink, what do they have? Yeah. Vodka, you know, water, vodka, yeah. soda, water, vodka yeah. tonic or whatever. So it's going to be the lowest calorie thing. Now, here's what I have to say about this. If you're going to go drink alcohol, um, you know, here's the real benefits of it. It's, it's the environment, the people you're with. It's, are you enjoying yourself? In which case, I don't care what kind of alcohol you're drinking. Pick the one that you enjoy because that's the point, right? Yeah. That's the whole point of, in my opinion. Well, no, if, that's, you're, if you're looking for one that's the healthiest, you're probably doing it too often. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. just going to no, say No, that's, that. really, that's a good point, Justin, because, I mean, we we just we were just in Florida. We would, at the day that Sal flew, Doug, Justin, and I, we basically laid out on the beach all day. You had the little flag, and they bring you over drinks and food. And uh, I had decided that this is a very rare occasion yeah. that the three of us lay out at the beach all day and have someone serving drinks to us. Not once did it cross my mind, ooh, what should I, I should get the lowest calorie <laughs> yeah, one. Dude. Like it's, I wanted the one that I wanted to enjoy window. because that's what I was doing at that point. It wasn't yeah. like a mission to get drunk. It wasn't just another weekend where I'm getting drunk again. It's like... This doesn't happen very often. I want to. We're in the sun, a you know fruity daiquiri type of drink, which is not something I would drink if I was in a bar or at a wedding or something like that. It was the, for the moment, and it never crossed my mind at how many calories it has compared to something. Yeah, else. I think you're missing the boat, and you're right, Justin. If you're like really like trying to you know get all the healthiest options, about you're probably drinking so much of it. That this is, <laughs> yeah, he's yeah. probably calm down. In which it. case, yeah, then it might yeah, you drink might, less. You might want to. Yeah, why don't you start by by drinking less? But yeah, it's. The, the the point isn't that right. So if I drink alcohol, I don't think to myself, 
what's the healthiest option? Uh, unless I drink a lot, I guess it would be, you know, what do I enjoy drinking? And I'm doing this with my friends and that's the whole point. You know, it's like, right. it's like if I go out to eat pizza, like, yeah, I could get the, the healthiest pizza version, but why not get the one that tastes the best because I'm with my friends and I'm enjoying myself, right, right. you know, type of deal. So I think that's the whole point. Now I will say this, um, you can, uh, you know, we work with a company called Zbiotic, and Zbiotic does. I mean, this is a pretty wild product. It definitely has a huge impact on the negative effects yeah. that I get from alcohol. Like when I drink alcohol, first off, I used to rarely, almost never drink it because I always felt like complete garbage the day after, always. And mm -hmm. so I almost never, I was like, almost never, yeah. just wasn't worth it. Didn't matter. Didn't have it. Now you'll see me have the occasional alcohol because the Zbiotics, I don't get that same inflamed, crappy, you know, feeling uh, afterwards, which I guess it comes from this this byproduct of alcohol that your body has trouble kind of breaking down. Which in which case is about so that that that's one thing you could do. In other words, pick the drink you want to have, enjoy yourself with your friends, and if you want to do something that'll maybe reduce some of the negative effects, then do the Zbiotics. But don't worry so much about the type of alcohol. Hey, if you enjoyed that clip, you can find the full episode here, or you can find other clips over here. And be sure to subscribe.